Boy's Diary on June 6. The topic is uh, addicted to read the subtitle of YouTube in Vietnamese. Vietnamese, not Chinese. Vietnamese. Okay, now I'm talking about uh, subtitles and then auditing. This is uh, my life and then I enjoy watching YouTube videos. Yeah. Besides, I do read subtitles in Vietnamese so since I learned Vietnamese. This is a unit and I'm going to talk about the building vocabulary or the read knowing sentences without any reference to context. And then since I started doing online language exchange and then mostly um, it's quite different uh, traditional learning people because now I um, live, I walk and then I enjoy travel, but I don't depend on traditional method. For example, traditional method, we uh, need books, reference book to study, and then we study vocabulary and then learning sentence and grammar. Sometimes we attend the academy or the, we need the um, instructor or teachers. And to learn foreign language is uh, uh, not easy anyway. So, and then um, now, and then it's newly different age to learn foreign languages. For example, uh, reading both subtitles of YouTube channel in life and in my life, and then I enjoy watching YouTube videos. Thinking about YouTube videos, I like uh, YouTube videos about some uh, topic and then news and sometimes I enjoy watching some kind of TED talk or Google talk or some uh, conference. Nowadays, I'm interested in AI. So, and then I watch many videos. And also I'm interested in the Vietnamese YouTuber who report uh, the, the fisherman's life. And then sometimes I enjoy them. So, and I watch YouTube videos uh, for more than three hours a day, even more. And then because when I sitting and then always is just uh, watching like addiction and then addicted to watching. YouTube videos. So, and then let's think about reading subtitles. In my habit, when I, whenever I watch YouTube videos uh, in Korean, English, and Vietnamese, I watch it with the subtitles. So, I read the subtitles and I listen to the English, Korean English and Vietnamese. So, and then and, uh, by doing that, um, I don't know. So, uh, when I started reading Vietnamese subtitle in, of, of YouTube, and then it was the beginner level in my, the beginner levels in Vietnamese, because uh, I don't know, words and then I don't have, uh, I don't build a, a vocabulary. So, and then I don't know the grammar and then I don't know 
the simple only knowing about the simple sentences uh, that uh, we use in normal life and then uh, others and then I just know about uh, some sense, um, not many words and then the simple sentences. So, and then uh, when I started reading the Vietnam subtitles of YouTube, and then I didn't realize it will it worked or it, it is effective. But now I think, and then it's quite effective. Because uh, it's uh, I too much read, I read a lot in the end. So and then and the words are repeat, repeat. For example, I think uh, and then uh, how much we read, uh, how much time hours uh, read, and then and the words and sentence and repeat it again and again. And then first time I didn't uh, recognize the words or the sentence, the pattern of the sentence. But uh, maybe from now on, and then maybe after six months, uh, I little bit realize about the pattern of the sentence and then frequently use the word. Sometimes I can realize about a new word because if I read one sentence, if I know the 90% words in the sentence, then and I can uh, find a uh, new word. So new word is, and then I can uh, uh, guess the meaning of new word. Also the pattern of the sentence is repeat, repeat, repeat. So, and then I can use it, uh, that the pattern. So if keeping, if I keep, reading uh, subtitles um, more than, uh, not more than, just to keep it maybe many years. And then and it's as the same as reading the books and a newspaper, magazine uh, in Korean, it's the same. What it means? It means I know about the languages just reading subtitles of YouTube. Of course, I studied doing online language exchange and then I study with the language parents, but it's, it's not much time, it's just uh, uh, less time. And then um, reading. So reading is much, much, more time uh, I spend many hours to, uh, reading Vietnamese actually is, and not only reading Vietnamese uh, but also enjoy watching YouTube videos when I watch YouTube videos I always uh, read Vietnamese subtitles of YouTube YouTube video and then by doing that and I can build uh, By doing that, I can build the vocabulary, and then I know about the sentence and grammar. So now I have a, I, I have confidence, and confidence in Vietnamese. And then, so, so the simple rule is reading subtitle is a very unique way to uh, learn the foreign language uh, nowadays. Uh, even I don't watch TV. Uh, in my room, no TV. Only then I as I I watch YouTube videos, and also that I focus on YouTube videos about uh, the conversation or documentary or the movie, and then whatever I watch YouTube videos, and then Korean, English, Vietnamese, and I read. Sometimes I, I just listen in Vietnamese, but uh, with the Korean and English and then always I use subtitles. Nowadays, YouTube videos have a good function of subtitles, very good. And then all the stuff and have support give uh, subtitles. So and then 
whoever, whoever uh, learn want to learn foreign languages, um, like me, and then reading subtitle of YouTube videos, it's a very good strategy to build vocabulary, sentence, learning about it, grammars. This is a good way, I think. And then uh, habit. Um, at least uh, you watch uh, more than one hour uh, a day and then read subtitle. That is the best way because uh, you can understand with the ears and then read the subtitles and then new and uh, until you're familiar with the, the word and sentence. Then and if you have it to read that and then maybe keep doing it. so it's uh, it helps you to read uh, books or newspaper or other things um, because uh, you already know about uh, many words. For example, if you if you watch one movie and then there is uh, people speak a lot very fast speak fast and then you use the subtitle that. And then at least two hours, you can, it's the same as the uh, amount of one book, the story of the one book. And then it's the same as the fact uh, that you read one book when you uh, read the subtitles with a movie on YouTube channel. That is amazing. Keep doing yeah. Roof lead with four pages watching. Not too much. I do talk about uh, reading subtitle of YouTube videos. And then I can get so, um, this is good. Nice. Anyway, Today's topic is about my addiction to reading subtitles on YouTube in Vietnam. I enjoy watching YouTube videos and reading the subtitles in Vietnam. 
A dialogue the language. This approach is unique because it has to build my vocabulary and understand them without leaving the reference to it. Since I started doing online language exchange, I have noticed how different it is from traditional learning method. All right, traditional approaches, I can integrate language learning into my daily activities. I work and travel and enjoy life and while learning without depending on textbook, reference book, or the formal question. Watching YouTube videos with subtitles in various languages, especially Vietnamese, has become a key part of my language learning process. I watch videos for more than three hours a day, enjoying content about topics like news, technology, tech talk, and AI. This practice has helped me improve my understanding of Vietnamese significantly. significantly. At first, reading Vietnamese subtitles was challenging because I didn't know many words or understand the grammar. However, over time, I've started to recognize the patterns in the sentence and frequently use the words. After about six months, I've noticed a substantial improvement in my ability to understand and <laughs> use the language. Reading subtitles literally exposes me to new words in context, allowing me to guess their meanings and remember them better. This method is similar to reading books, newspapers, or magazines in Korea. It's an effective way to learn a language because it combines listening and reading, language both skills to be transferred. Nowadays, I don't have a TV in my room. Instead, I focus on YouTube videos with conversation, documentaries, movies, and more, so all with subtitles. I listen to content in Korean, English, and Vietnam, so using subtitles to aid in my understanding. For anyone looking to learn a new language, I highly recommend spending at least an hour, an hour a day in reading subtitles on YouTube. It's a fantastic way to familiarize yourself to using new words and sentence structures. Once you become comfortable with this method, you can move on to reading books, newspapers, or other materials in the target language. In summary, my experience with reading YouTube subtitles has boosted my confidence in Vietnamese. It's a simple yet effective way to learn, and I believe it. It can work and then for others to keep it, keep it. And soon so you will significantly progress in your language skills. On June 6th, it says, I discussed my addiction to reading that I miss subtitles on YouTube, and watching YouTube videos and reading subtitles. I'm learning the language in a unique way. This method builds my vocabulary understanding of sentences without pressing of three A's. I started online language exchange and notice native perform the conventional learning, unlike the original method. I integrate language learning into my daily life to make it more enjoyable. I watch YouTube videos for over three hours a day with the various topics like news, technology, and AI. Initially, reading Vietnamese subtitles was challenging due to limited vocabulary and grammar knowledge. Over time, I began to recognize sentence patterns and frequently used words. After six months with my comprehension improved significantly. Repeatedly reading subtitles helped me guess new world meanings and remember them better. This method is akin to reading books or magazines in my native languages that effectively combine listening and reading in post skills. I don't have a TV on, so I focus on YouTube content with subtitles. I watch and listen to foreign news and better news. For language learners, I recommend spending at least one hour daily reading YouTube subtitles. This practice of formalizing oneself with new words and sentence structures. Once comfortable, one can progress to reading other materials in the target language. So my experience with subtitles has boosted my confidence in Vietnamese proving, proving it to be a simple and effective learning method. And then today's topic is about my addition to reading. And then uh, same story about the, uh, let's see, came back. ไหนเต้าตันสาวโดยอโนยเวดิกเงินบอกผู้เดียวเชิงเกียรติเช่นสังวิดีโอเชิงวิดบาร์ดอกผู้เดียวบางทีเวดยุโดยหกนุ่ง
주제 두 무치 특 아콩예 에 만다 아믹 독 주제 징벳 첫고 안요 도이 홍주에 뉴드가 뉴팝 주니엔 사홍 사홍 음 도이 다한년 다이 수파치 당최 종가나 휴 마수주 농민 독 주제 락디 락라이 적토이 동야 보스 탁투모 바뇨 중도 한번 하나의 또의 공고 TV바 탁총바 각노신 첸 유튜브 거부제 음 토이네 바 샘노 중 방청한 등한 바 등빛 아 또의 오이 뉴욕 목문헉 농모이 도이 쿠엔엔 잔 잇냥 모지오 모이나이 데 독푸제 찬 유튜브 빈니엔 독푸제 다즙 도이 푸틴 황 모이 캔벳 바 도이 캔랑 풍팍나이 풍세 규파 모이 모이파 오케이 Reviewing about uh, what I read, and then it's good. <clears throat> so living is a very good way to uh, checking out the feedback from AI. AI gives good reading is uh, very useful. After I talk, and then I can get a good sentence, good structure, sentence structures, so just uh, AI, did. and then I use it, it's better than before that. I use that AI give, and then I, I can use the feedbacks and uh, so good. And then the reviewing is very good. And then also the about the reading subtitles. The, what I talk one, and then and this is uh, the best way to build vocabulary, the knowing sentences, keeping reading, and then because uh, in fact, if you enjoy watching video, YouTube videos, and then so you spend uh, one or two hours a day, and then just uh, you you have a target languages, for example, English or other foreign language. You have a target language, just English or other foreign language. And then I recommend you to read the subtitles, always set up the subtitles and then your eyes focus on and simultaneously, just like uh, when you go into the cinema and then you watch the screen and then and there are some uh, foreign movies and the foreign movie means uh, some uh, you don't understand what they uh, what uh, you don't understand and uh, you don't understand uh, the actors uh, what they have at the time that you read the subtitles it's the same and then uh, you understand. Korean and what your target languages are reading. But this way is unique. It's, it, these times you don't read your own uh, languages. You read the target languages too. So, and then when you read the target language, when you read the target language, you don't understand the, 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 what you read, but you understand what you listen. This is a unique strange. But and then keeping keep reading and then watching that enjoy and then if you have it to read the subtitles uh, uh, in the target languages and then and uh, you build the vocabulary you familiar with the sentence and then maybe someday you can understand uh, what you read that is my suggestion about this I, I talk about that and then that I got a, the <clears throat> the proof lead uh, <clears throat> and the feedback from the uh from from the i got the feedback from the uh, ai i got the feedback from the ai
Okay, now I got it. After living what I need, I believe that living is a very good way to check how people from AI. AI is in complete tasks such as using three recommendation at the address. I can then get good sentence for first and I use the feedback to improve. Watching videos with subtitles is one of the best ways to view vocabulary and understand terms and structures. If you enjoy watching YouTube video, I recommend the setting the language to English or other language. Watching YouTube cinema. We subtitles uh, is beneficial because even if you don't understand even everything, seeing the subtitles will help you learn the language. And for example, if you watch a Korean movie and you don't understand the actors, the subtitles will help you understand the language and the context. This method is unique because even if you don't read the subtitles in your native language, you begin to understand it by listening, and reading, and performing. Uh, watching videos through subtitle and video with the process. If you immerse yourself in video and subtitle in the target language, you will start to understand more. This is why I suggested using subtitle as a powerful tool for language learning based on the feedback I've received from AI. Sure. Living is a good way to get a feedback from AI, which can help improve sentence structure. Watching videos is a effective way to use vocabulary and understand sentence structure. Setting the language to English or other foreign language on YouTube helps with this learning process. And the subtitles are assisting in understanding the language, even if you don't fully understand the echoes. This method is unique because it involves listening and reading in the target language. Immersing yourself in videos with subtitles in the target language, read the word, to wear a comprehension and language learning. ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ต
xem YouTube cinema rồi thu xem chất thú vị vì nhà tại các kỹ văn không chịu mỗi thứ việc xem thu xem sẽ giúp văn học mong muốn ví dụ như văn đang xem một bộ phim văn học và không hiểu không hiểu thật diễn biến ở thu xem sẽ giúp văn sự mong muốn và mong cả như các phương pháp này là nhiều nhất vì ngài các chị và không tóc thu xe và nông nữ mẹ trẻ của mình vân vân bắt đầu từ văn các nghề gốc văn nông nữ nước ngộ thể tiếp tục sản xuất video của thu xe và tân phương khoa sinh nhật như bàn tăng minh trong các video và thư thể và ngôn ngữ mục tiêu và sẽ bắt đầu như người thân đây là lý do tại sao tôi đề xuất xuất sử dụng thư thể như mô phong tử học thật mạng mẹ của tên phát hội mà tôi đã nhận được dù ấy à cách tốt tích tự nhất chấp Phân hồi từ AI là trái nghĩ cấp thiết trong cuộc sống hàng ngày. Thì video của Phú Tệ là một phương pháp hiệu quả để sử dụng khi dân và hiệu quả thúc cáo đất ông nông ngữ yêu sự sáng thiên an phổ nâng ngữ nước nước ngồi thất xe chiếc ít cho việc khóc Phú Tệ trước cho nông ngữ và như thân ngãi và khi bạn hỏi thì các chuyên biệt phương pháp này bảo hôn nhẹ và tốt bạn nên mất chiếu để chụp hôn tạm nên trong video của thu thể sẽ dành đến chiếu viết và hút nông nghiệp tốt hồn. Xong.